Yo, what's up guys? It's Yellowfin, and in this video, I'm going to be joining the Koenigsegg Yesco Attack Prelims event. So, I've got a pretty solid hand. I think I showed it before, but these track sets are looking pretty good. So, let's just jump right on into it and see how we can do. And also, I do want to see what others have. So, so far, it looks pretty easy. But, let's see. Honestly, this is going to be pretty interesting. Um, let's do G-Force, Rolling Start, Tokyo Loop, and 0-60. to 60. Hand is looking pretty solid, honestly. Oh, I for kind of forgot to show you guys what the hand was. It is a 223 Mazda Furai, nearly maxed out. Here, we have the 111 Mazda 787B, which is going to absolutely destroy that Mazda R500. Next up after that, we've got a 233 Mazda 3 TCR, 68 points right there. Then right here, Mazda Familia Sport, maxed out at 323. And then right here, we have the 323 Mazda CX-30. 75 point win right there. 543 to zero. And that is what win, geez, I can't speak. Win number one of five that we're going to be doing. All right, next race. Yeah, we can probably beat this guy. See, this is the interesting track set. This is where they give us the test bowl on the rain, but we should be fine anyways. There isn't really any good test bowl rain cars, not gonna lie, but this is just what we'll have to work with. Hopefully we don't lose by too many points with the Mazda Familia. The Mazda Familia was honestly my best choice to use. So let's see how much we lose by. Oh, only 50. All right. So yeah, that's fine if we lose just by a little bit. 50 point loss is not really going to hurt us that much. Then the 787B destroys the MX-5 GT race car. Here, hopefully the CX-30 can beat the CX-9. I'd assume it can. Yep, 50 points right there. And then this last race, the 3 TCR, will obviously beat the RX-7 Type RS. So there we go, that's that one done, 2-0 now. And yeah, so let's see if there's like, there really isn't anything else I could run. I mean, I could run maybe the RX-7 instead of the Familia. But I believe, yeah, like there's Tokyo Bridge wet, Tokyo Off-Ramp wet. It's so like, honestly, I feel like the Familia would be a bit better then. Yeah, see, this guy's got two fur eyes, but I can beat him. Um, this guy's also got a fur eye. That's why I also dropped some fuses into my fur eye, because I know people will have upgraded fur eyes. But all of these guys look pretty beatable as of right now. So let's just go for... Um, where's someone we can three-star? Because honestly, I'd like a three-star. We can go for this one. <laughs> this one's probably fine. I want to use this on the rolling start. That can go on Tokyo Drag, One Mile Drag, G-Force, and Off-Ramp. Off-Ramp will be interesting to see if the Familia can beat the Cosmo. Okay, Tokyo Drag, we lose by 50, but that's fine. That's not too bad of a loss. Then the Familia Sport 4. Can it beat the Cosmo? It can. That is good to know. So the Familia Sport 4 can win on the Tokyo Off-Ramp against the Mazda Cosmo. Here, we're going to destroy their Mazda 3 MPS. 187 points there. Then right here, we'll get a nice win too on the G-Force test, 50 points. And then right here, the 3 TCR will beat the MX-5 Cup with 67 points. 354 to 50. And now we are 4-0. I believe I only played three tickets though, which means someone else lost to us. Um, do I recognize anyone in the top? No. Honestly, a tier one would be amazing if that's possible. So far, I haven't seen any hands. Ooh, never mind. I don't think tier one is possible with hands like this. Let's see. Let's think about it real quick, though. Yeah, see, that's the maxed for Rai. And max. Okay, yeah, no. No thinking about it's happening there. Here we can win, though. Here we can win. And there we can win. Let's go for this guy. Why not? I do want to see if that RX-7 loses on Tokyo Bridge. Tokyo Loops a win as well. Um, I guess we'll just go for the three wins, because why not? Glad I put the fuses into my Furai, though. Makes it definitely a lot more useful. Nearly maxed out, too. It's just the only thing is I don't want to put a 16-hour fuse into the Furai, and then, like, have to wait 16 hours to play the event again. But yeah, my Familia was able to win that there, so that was good. 50 points right here. Then the 787B wins against the Furai, so there's 50 more points. And the 3 TCR wins right there by 58. So that's pretty nice. 258 to 0. And the last one. Can we get a final 3 star to clear that prize board? 
Let's see. Well, yeah, we definitely can three star this. Ooh, actually, we should get enough bonus points, though. So let's check out the other hands first, though. There's that guy. He's got a similar hand to the other guy, but just a lot of Mazda Fur Eyes. I believe we could beat him, though. Yeah, we can beat him. This guy as well. There's two wins right there. Three wins. Four wins. Yeah, we have four wins there. That's an easy win. And that's an easy win. Um, But, I mean, we did kind of want a three-star to clear the prize board. But, like, we can beat this guy. I feel like we should probably go for this guy just for the track set that it is. Since on the triple drag track set, they could get us. Maybe. With how many bonus points they might receive. But, I feel like this is probably the best idea. Is to take give him a loss right now okay so i don't think a tier one's possible honestly i did already see that one hand that was pretty good and i've like kind of just joined this event but tier two definitely is possible i kind of prefer tier two anyway because i do want that other mazda um the mazda six i would prefer that one but this will be a pretty interesting event hopefully i can pull off a carbon fiber that'll make like a carbon fiber reward video or something and then hopefully i can get a pretty solid pull from this pack as well because there are a few Mazdas that I'd like. Can we grab the Volvo? Yep, there's the Volvo. So let's sell all of this real quick and then like I can show like there are quite a few really nice Mazdas that we can get from this pack. The 757, the 6 Sky Active D race car, the 717C, the RX Vision, the Miata race car. I keep on thinking it says pace car but it doesn't, it says race car. Um, then there's some cool epics too that I'd be happy with. Any of the epics I don't already own or another CX-30, even another 3 TCR. So really any epic I'd be happy with. And then there's a lot of really good ultra rares as well, like the Mazda Speed of Tenza is a cool one. Also has really good stats too. 5684 is not that bad. Um, the 626 MPS, the CX-50 is a good one. Like there's a lot of different good cars I can get. And then hopefully if I get the carbon, it'll be for the Mazda 6 Grand Touring because that also does not look like too bad of a car. But we'll honestly just have to see. Do need to also play 15 more tickets. Event ends in a day and 19 hours. So I believe I've got plenty of time to do that. And I already have the CX-90 maxed out. That one is right there, 5484. So it is a good car for tier one, but I'd rather take the new car that I don't already own. And so, yeah, I believe that'll probably be it for this video. So if you like this type of content, make sure to like, subscribe. Join the Discord server, link in the description. I'm Yellowfin. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.